What's up? Gamer90 here, and I am posting this video um, on Random Machinima 2012. Um, if you've seen my personal channel, you would have seen this uh, controller shell that I put up um, on there after I painted it. It's all hand painted. Um, I did use spray paint, but as you, as you can see, it's really well done. I'm very proud of the way it came out. It has that nice little shine on the back. I'm going to go ahead and move this. This one is the first one I ever did. This is my personal controller, my Sith controller, my Clan Tech from Call of Duty, Sith in the Arabesh. I know the writing and stuff came out real crappy, but I was using a really crappy um, X-Acto blade until I got my, my good one for cutting and everything. Uh, so my Sith logo, the Arabesh, and I have the Galactic Empire symbol on the left side handle, and then my <laughs> my PlayStation Network ID really crappy because, like I said, really crappy <coughs> uh, knife using it to cut. But yeah, so that's the first one I ever did. Like I said, I'm proud of this one too. I like the the finish. It's still glossy, but it's not as smooth. It has a bit of texture to it, which I like um, a bit more than the really smooth one. But that's just me. It comes down to personal preference. But the main thing I'm making this video for here today is because I put up the shell, this one here, on uh, eBay, and it's going for <laughs> the highest bid right now is two dollars and twenty-five cents. <laughs> God damn it! But uh, yeah, so I put that one up. Hopefully, it'll go up. But I made this video today to show you this one. This one here is the complete one that I just finished. It's kind of the same design as this one here, but as you can see, I've added a couple of different touches to it. The skull is white, just a little bit different. Instead of it being silver with the black chain link fence, it's black with the silver chain link fence, which I think looks a little bit better uh, with the paint. And also, I have the silver like paint splatter on it as well. You know, the painted D-pad. Uh, keep in mind, also, this controller is not cleared yet, which is why it doesn't shine like the other one. So you can see this is just raw paint right now. But I painted the D-pad, which was, it came out real nice. The D-pad is cleared, however. So that's why it has that nice little shimmer to it, as you can see right there. And I also painted the face buttons, which are also clear. Uh, clear coated, I mean. So you got the silver with the black paint uh, spiders. Same thing with the D-pad. Standard PlayStation button, black with the silver center. And also the painted eyeballs of the analog sticks. So they're silver with the black paint specks as well. The white skull, like I said. Turn over to the back. Kind of the same design as the other ones. Got this the chain link fence, silver. This one came out kind of funky, I don't know why. Oh no, this is, looks weird on camera. Never mind. Walls JK everybody! And um we have it right here on the side as well, the chain link fence. Also, it goes mostly silver on the front with the, the black right here on the right side, and it fades more to black in the back side here, like this. So it's like, it's kind of like split in half right here. So there you go. Uh, the controller is dead right now, so I can't turn it on, but uh, something like this, I would love to sell and get off my hands. Uh, the controller is practically brand new. As you can see, the analog sticks have next to no wear on them. Uh, I just want to get off my hands, get some spare cash for my for my airbrush so um check out uh on ebay i'm gonna put this controller up for auction see how it does something like this i would like to sell for like 60 or 70 bucks because the controller works perfectly fine and because of the time that i put into it to paint it i know it's just spray paint but still it takes it takes quite a while it takes me about a day or two to put this together like that so yeah, that's pretty much the whole reason I made this video today. Just to show you the work that I was doing on the controllers. So there is the four that I've done. This one was first. This one uh, was the third one. The second one, I don't know where it's at right now. It was a black and white controller. Yeah, this was the third one, and then this is the latest one, which has the cooler design on it. 
yeah, so take a look on eBay. If you see this, these controllers, not this one, this one's mine. You can't have this. Uh, this one I'm not even going to bother selling because it's for PS2. Unless you want that, you can tell me. But this one's already up there. I'm going to put this one up there right now and see how it does. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you like what you see. And uh, drop me a line. So until next time, I'm Gamer90. Happy gaming to you.